Did NASA's James Webb Space Telescope observe a planet in a distant solar system that might support life? In a groundbreaking moment for astronomy, the James Webb Space Telescope has pierced the vastness of space to capture an image beyond our solar system. This isn't just any image, it's a revelation that could reshape our understanding of the universe. Today, in this video, we will discuss the recent image captured by the James Webb Telescope that could uncover the secrets about the habitable planets. In 1963, Russian astrophysicist Nikolai Kardashev introduced a groundbreaking concept to measure the developmental progress of civilizations based on their energy consumption, known as the Kardashev scale. Developed while studying the Quasar CTA-102 and contemplating the potential existence of extraterrestrial civilizations far more advanced than humanity, the scale categorizes civilizations into three types. Type 1 civilizations can harness the entire energy of their planet. Type 2 can utilize the full power of their host star. And Type 3 can tap into the energy of an entire galaxy. Do you know where Earth stands on this scale? Let us know your thoughts in the comment section below. The Dyson Sphere, proposed by physicist Freeman Dyson, is a theoretical structure for capturing a star's total energy to detect advanced alien civilizations. Variants include the Dyson Swarm, a collection of orbiting solar collectors, and the Dyson Shell, a massive star-enclosing structure often featured in sci-fi. These constructs would shift a star's radiation towards infrared wavelengths, aligning with energy conservation laws. In 2016, NASA's Curiosity rover made an unexpected discovery. They found tritomite in a rock sample from Mars Gale Crater, challenging previous beliefs about Martian volcanism. Researchers later explained that the mineral likely formed in an underground magma chamber before being ejected during an eruption. This discovery has significant implications for understanding Mars' geological history. The 2018 discovery of organic molecules on Mars by the Curiosity rover sparked intense interest in the search for Martian life. Fluctuating methane levels on the planet have led to theories ranging from comet impacts to possible microbial activity. While meteorites like the Nakla meteorite offer intriguing clues with their complex carbonaceous materials, the question of life on Mars remains unresolved. The InSight mission, which landed on Mars in November 2018, has been studying the planet's geological structure with a heat probe and seismometer. It recently recorded its strongest quake yet, with a magnitude of five puzzling experts about its origins. On February 18, 2021, NASA's Mars 2020 mission landed the Perseverance rover and Ingenuity helicopter on Mars to explore the possibility of past microbial life and prepare for future human missions. Perseverance will analyze rocks for biosignatures and study the planet's climate and geology while also converting CO2 into oxygen. NASA's James Webb Space Telescope recently identified an exoplanet, K218b, located beyond our solar system, which shows potential to sustain life. The telescope detected methane and carbon dioxide on this planet, about 8.6 times larger than Earth. These findings suggest that K218b might be classified as a Hycean exoplanet, Exoplanets refer to planets located outside our solar system. The term Hycean is derived from merging hydrogen and ocean, and it characterizes planets believed to possess hydrogen-dominant atmospheres coupled with oceans of liquid water, as explained by Space.com. Additionally, dimethyl sulfide, or DMS, is potentially present in K218b. On our planet, DMS is a compound typically associated with living organisms. As stated by NASA, K218b, it is positioned within the habitable zone, implying its proximity to its star could permit the presence of water on its surface. Such regions are often termed Goldilocks zones, inspired by the classic children's tale, signifying that the conditions are ideally suited for life. The planet exhibited high levels of methane and carbon dioxide and a noticeable absence of ammonia. This suggests the possibility of an ocean beneath K218b's atmosphere rich in hydrogen, as per NASA's observations. The presence of DMS on the planet has led scientists to speculate about the possibility of life there. This is because on Earth, DMS is produced by phytoplankton, 
a type of marine algae that serves as a food source for marine life and is synthesized through sunlight. Niku Madhusudan, an esteemed astronomer from the University of Cambridge and the primary author of the study, stated, Future observations from Webb should determine if significant amounts of DMS truly exist in K218b's atmosphere. K218b, positioned within the habitable zone, is known to contain carbon-based molecules. However, this doesn't automatically imply it can sustain life, given its substantial size, about 2.6 times the Earth's radius. It's believed that the planet might possess a vast mantle of high-pressure ice, similar to Neptune yet it might have a thinner, hydrogen-rich atmosphere and a surface ocean. While Hycean worlds are theorized to feature vast water oceans, there's also a possibility that K218b's ocean might be too hot to either support life or remain in a liquid state. Subhajit Sarkar from Cardiff University elaborated, While our solar system doesn't have a planet of this kind, sub-Neptunes are the galaxy's most prevalent planet type. Our detailed spectrum of a habitable zone sub-Neptune has allowed us to identify its atmospheric molecules. Characterizing exoplanets' atmospheres, which involves determining their gases and conditions, is a burgeoning field in astronomy. However, the brilliance of their much larger host stars often overshadows these planets, making studying their atmospheres challenging. To overcome this, the team analyzed the light from K218 star as it traversed the planet's atmosphere. Being a transiting exoplanet, K218b causes a diminution in brightness as it moves across its star's face. This method led to its initial discovery in 2015 via NASA's K2 mission. During such transits, a minuscule portion of the starlight travels through the exoplanet's atmosphere before reaching instruments like the James Webb Space Telescope. This journey of starlight through the atmosphere leaves identifiable marks, enabling astronomers to deduce the atmospheric gases of the exoplanet. The remarkable sensitivity and extended wavelength range of the Webb telescope made it possible to detect spectral features with just a couple of transits robustly, highlighted Madhusudan. To put it in perspective, a single transit observation with Webb offers precision similar to eight Hubble observations taken over several years and within a more limited wavelength spectrum. Savas Constantinou from the University of Cambridge added, our current results, based on just two observations of K218b, are merely the tip of the iceberg. They showcase the potential of Webb in studying exoplanets within the habitable zone. Their findings have been approved for publication in the Astrophysical Journal Letters. The research team is gearing up for further studies using Webb's MIRI Mid-Infrared Instrument Spectrograph. They anticipate that this will validate their current results and shed light on the conditions prevailing on K218b. Madhusudan concluded with a broader vision, our end game is to identify life on a habitable exoplanet, reshaping our understanding of our position in the cosmos. Our current insights mark a significant stride towards comprehending Hycean planets in this grand journey. While planets such as K218b remain largely enigmatic, according to NASA, some space researchers are optimistic about their potential as sites to uncover life. Madhu Sudan emphasized, Our research highlights the need to explore a variety of potentially habitable settings when looking for life beyond our planet. While traditionally the quest for extraterrestrial life has been centered on smaller terrestrial planets, the expansive Hycean planets present a more favorable environment for atmospheric studies. Ongoing Voyage Through the Cosmos the James Webb Space Telescope emerges as a symbol of humanity's ingenuity, revealing the universe's hidden secrets. Will the James Webb Space Telescope be able to find civilization beyond our solar system? Join the cosmic conversation below. If this video left you starstruck, show some galactic love with a thumbs up that shines brighter than a supernova. And don't just float away, hit that subscribe button with the force of a meteor. Before you rock it off, Click on the video displayed on the screen for a journey through more celestial tales.